Coming up next, we get to this UFC middleweight division fight. is now underway. We'll see how long it goes. You've got a submission specialist on one side and on the other side. Maybe the most well-rounded fighter in this league. Yeah, he is one of the best fighters in the entire UFC. But in front of him, he has one of the most dangerous fighters across all divisions in the octagon. Because that one skill he has is so good that you're, un you're in danger. The entire Master time. of the transition. Nice scramble. And he landed the right hand there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Oh! Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Big head kick. Guard lands the right hand. All right, single collar tie now. Takedown defense holds up. He's got him right here. Oh, he might be out. Just misses with a left hook there. Just over two minutes to go. Oh man, that's a nice kick right there. Oh, huge right hand! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's gotta press him. He's gotta go chase that finish down now. This fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He did stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent on the floor low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Jared Kennedy. Oh, and he defends another takedown there. So it looked like a pretty good entry, but once again, unable to get him down. Great bounce. He's our man. Gets up again here, but hurt him. Try to establish that jab. Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end. Muscle. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Second round, straight ahead. So there's the horn. Let us now look back at some of the action in that round, DC. And he had his takedown game going early and off. Yeah, he had it going great. I mean, he did a great job of finding his entries, rushing to his finishes before his po opponent could react and defend him. He should be very proud of the work he did over the course of that last round. Cut to the head. That one, though, blocked by the defense. Wow! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, nice right hand. All right, so he's... There, DC. He is officially blocked. Oh, big. He's out. Perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So 
Just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliotta is going to stop to this contest at 51 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout.